St. Patrick's Day is just around the corner and it's the busiest time of year for dancers who specialize in Irish dance. A Maple Grove studio has something to brag about this season. One of their youngest champions qualified for the world competition in Ireland. Here's reporter Shannon Slatton. There's something about the cadence of Irish dancing that will stick in your head long after a routine is over. For 10-year-old Morgan Wright, it's a beat that's continually in her head. Because I practice a lot, and, and not just like in my basement or my dance stage, but like around the hallway and stuff, I just do a bunch of stuff randomly. I find myself dancing. And elsewhere, too. I find myself dancing in school, too. All those steps, all that practice paid off. This one, I won my championship. It's bigger. That big trophy means Morgan is the youngest champion from Rinka Nua Irish Dance in Maple Grove to qualify for world competition in Ireland. We're just so thrilled to have a dancer who started with us at age four and became a champion by age 10 and qualified for worlds. Morgan is one of a new team of Irish dancers here who focus on competition. A lot of our dancers want to become a champion or qualify to compete at worlds. And I was just feeling that with how competitive it is now these days, that the dancers that wanted to do that needed some extra individualized attention. So the dance school added another team in the fall, pushing for perfection in both hard and soft shoe. I like both of them, but hard shoe has a lot more like different technique skills and stuff, and it's challenging, so I like hard shoe better. It might be hard work, but these dancers have a good time together. Start it and you never look back from there because you have so much fun, you won't want to go back to not dancing anymore. As far as Morgan, the young champion, how long will she keep dancing? 100 million, I don't know. <laughs> I want to stick with dancing for a long time. For these dancers, that might not be long enough. In Maple Grove, Shannon Slatton, CCX News. The dance studio has modified their plans due to the coronavirus outbreak. They canceled nursing home visits and many performances. They did, however, get to stream a special performance this week for grandparents and seniors. Find more local news stories at ccxmedia.org and follow us on social media.